Welcome to you ladies, my name is Jack Except the Guy, and welcome back to Oli Oli Oxen Free. We're heading out, just me and Jonas, heading out to set up the signals to go to the bomb shelter type of stuff, and hopefully my mic sounds better this time. I don't know what happened last time. I recorded this and party hard in the same day, and for some reason they were just like uh audio quality wise, so hopefully it's okay this time. Check, check, check. Is it good? Should be good. Okay, moving on to the oh wait, are we going to the Oh, what's happening? Oh, Ren is drowning in the upside down. Alex, Alex, okay, are you, are you back to normal? I just saw, it, it, it was like a premonition, I think, and I know that sounds whatever, but this must be what it's like when people say they do that, because I kind of just saw Ren drowning. Okay, okay, just take it easy for a second. You went all red-eyed, like when we get possessed. You guys take this awfully cavalier. I did? You stopped walking and started mumbling, and then your eyes lit up like little road flares. It only lasted like a minute, but we should hurry up and do this before the door on you opens any wider to them. Yeah. Yeah, uh, let's get this over with. <laughs> I saw Ren drowning, and then she was like, I just had a premonition, and I know that sounds crazy, I'm like, I think we're pretty used to the crazy by now. Uh, we are going up. We are going up to the Epiphany Field, right? Um, it's like, I think, this must be, wait, are we? What was my job? I can't remember if my job is to actually go to the, the thing, the bomb shelter, or go to the tower to set up the signals for the bomb shelter. Oh, this is why you record all at once and not leave it four days in between. <laughs> but yeah, if you start seeing ghosts and people being possessed and everything, I don't think you have to turn around and then be like, I know this sounds crazy. Pretty sure crazy is baked in by now. I don't think I went this way before. Wait. I just want to see what's up here. I know I have to go this direction or whatever, but might be a beacon up here. Giant man statue with a telescope. That's pretty neato. Jump! <laughs> that's cool. Kinda wish there was a bit more going on here. But that's cool. Or a starry sky or something. Whatever. Semantics. Let's get back to the task at hand. You okay, Jonas? You feeling good? I'm channeling my inner Jonas with my beanie. That's why I put this on. That and to hide the frickin' unkept lawn that is my head. Up we go. <laughs> ah, no, hey! look, it kinda made sense. Hey, guys. Uh... Wait. Did I get the plan wrong? Cause if I got it right... No, you didn't get it wrong. You're supposed to be yellow brick roading it to the wood station right about now. I saw... I saw Ren drowning in a... The only way to describe it is it was like a vision or something. What? Seriously? Alex got possessed for a minute there, and yes, it was scary, but it was just a hallucination triggered by ghosts rummaging around through her brain. No big deal, I mean, no. they're clearly fine. Look, well Jonas, it was real, alright? As real as the other loops or any of the other hundred crazy things that have happened tonight. Don't say that! What am I supposed to do with this? It's not like I can really avoid drowning any more than I can normally do on a daily basis. <laughs> You're on land, Ren. I don't think anything's gonna happen. But then- Just what? be careful, alright? I don't know why I saw what I saw, but just keep on your toes, okay? Well, I am now. Yeah. Okay, well, it's been fun catching up, kids. We'll go do our half of the fix the ghost problem equation now. <sighs> alright, well, uh, see you after. See I just you in an so. hour! Don't say that! <laughs> oh, wrong one. So we are going to the woods. I can't remember. Normally it has like these big fucking things written everywhere. Use the response to open bomb shelter. Yeah, could you fucking tell me what it is? Or am I going to Edwards Woods or... All I know is I think I'm going this way. Go up! Alex, there you go. Up and around. Snake it on around. Also, something that I forgot last time. Remember when I, in the first episode, I saw the mirror. Was it the first episode? No, second episode. When I was trying to save Clarissa, the mirror told me, tell Michael to break up with Clarissa. And then I went back in time, 
And I forgot to tell Michael to break up with Clarissa, because I completely forgot that the game actually told me to do that. But I don't know if I should have. Everyone was saying that I should have done that, but this game is also being very deceitful. So I don't know if I should have done that. You don't know. And also, apparently, there's a lot of different, uh... Am I going to this one, or am I going further? I don't know. There's also, apparently, multiple endings to this game, which means I'm probably going to get the bad one. Hopefully not. Hopefully there's some solace in the ending I get. I can't remember where I'm going. Do you know what time it is? 4.20? <laughs> it's 4 in the morning. Which is usually about the time everyone decides if they're going to bed or ordering another three pizzas. Yeah? What's your vote usually in, uh, that situation? Pizza! The exact words I was gonna say! Uh, never leave pizza on the table. It's like getting 11 in blackjack. Just double down. Don't even think about it. You think this tuning into the tear thing's gonna work? Uh... Like, really? I don't fucking know, Jonas. Do I look like... A ghost? It really doesn't matter if I think it's gonna work. It's sort of all we have, and we're running out of time. Yeah, it is all I we think have. This, yeah, um, I just stuff I just wish I felt like the ghosts were from, like, concerned their that their plan won't work. Something. This is so weird. Um, Did you get all yeah, that? <laughs> it's not exactly a good omen. I think we're running out of runway here. Yeah. <laughs> Gotta love when they talk over each other. Really understanding what they're saying then. Okay, I must be going in the right direction then, because all of this shit is everywhere. Oh, no, 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 no. We have to do our mega jump, remember? Ah! That fucking one at a time, Jonas! Christ, man! Could have fallen and hopped my head off the concrete, and then where we, would we be? We'd both be ghosts then. You would be a ghost because I'd come back and haunt your ass and kill you for killing me. I go the right way. I sure hope so. So let's go back to the, like the relay tower, or the relay point, whatever the hell it's called on the map. If you guys keep talking, I know I'm going in the right direction because I'm triggering new things. Now the station's up at the top of the hill. <sighs> I hope this works. Jonas, ease off the fucking Buzz Killington vibes for a second. Okay? Everything's- oh, I hope this works. Do you think this is gonna work? Oh, Alex, how are you feeling? Jonas, it's fucking fine, we got this. It's at the top of the hill. Oh, this one or the other one? Uh, this one. Cause this is- this is- I went up here before- the station's up at the top of the hill. I hope this works. Ah, shit. Ugh, <sighs> not this again. We're in another time maze thing. Ugh, okay. We were due. It's been like a minute since the last one. Yeah. Now the station's up at the top of the hill. Ah, I hope fuck. this works. Yep, I am also... hope that. I am also hope that, Jonas! Anything to dick around with in here? No. Maybe I have to go left then. Need to find the tape player to fix this shit. I love the the VHS effect that appears at the top of the screen. Balls, man. This is new. Ren, Nona, what happened? What's wrong with Ren? Ren, he's he had an accident. He he died. I couldn't. What? How? I, I mean, yeah, we just saw you. How how did this happen? He he drowned. He took a fall. I don't know. He just he just stopped. Where is he now? I mean, does it really matter what happened? Either way, done is done. And done in this case is. Shut up, okay? <laughs> just shut the hell up. Yeah, I don't fight back. More of your ghost garbage, all right? It isn't garbage, and we're not ghosts. Don't be rude. Alex, we know you're in charge, and we know your plan, and we also know that your plan won't work. It never does. So we have a proposition for you. A deal. A bargain, really. Um, a proposition? 
Like, like what? It's already over, Nicholas. She's gone. We'll pilot her through the rest of existence, and there's nothing you can do to change that. But if you agree to let us take her, let her go quietly and without fuss. You won't slaughter the rest of your friends, like young Wrenched over here. We leave the rest of your cattle alone. No! no really not gonna happen! Leave no man behind! No! No! No way! I'm saving everyone! Everyone is coming home with me. We're all getting out of here. Uh, courage is not always the way, dear. Well, I'm a shoulder. Much time left. Do you know how we know you don't have much time left? Because mm -hmm. I don't Fine. know. Shoot. How do you know? We know because we can be Jonas for this long, and his soul is as quiet as an empty church. Just never say we didn't provide you all. I sir, fuck no idea what's going on. Jonas, come out, little buddy. Hack, stupid time loops. I hate some. I do. Anybody? Ah, tape players, and somebody. Jonas, is that you? And just after I say Ren, don't drown, what did he do? Oh, Geronimo off a bridge. Oh, that Ren. I also said, let's go find Ren in an episode. And then I said, and let's also go find Hummingbird. And a lot of people didn't get the joke, because a Ren is a bird. A W-R-E-N. It's not a very good joke, but it was there. <laughs> I tried. This is a good one. Nice. Who is this? No, I know he was your best friend, Alex. I I'm sorry. I don't. I don't know what happened. One minute he was there, and then he was just. It's okay, Nona. You. You didn't do anything wrong. I know it's not your fault. Of course, it's not your fault. I didn't know him that well, but I like what I'd gotten to know. Aww. I'm sorry. It's. I shouldn't. It's colossally stupid of me to talk about him like that with you here. This is. <sighs> He was more important. No, not really. Ren would be flattered to hear you say anything about him, so if he can hear this at all, trust me, he's over the moon right now. Sure. Mm -hmm. It's a tiny thing, but I hope he knew that I liked him. Oh, no! And I don't know if he did. He hopes he did. I think that's enough. Like I said, it's a tiny thing. Oh. See, that's the thing! They keep... Like showing people falling off windows and smacking onto the ground and everything. But then Clarissa was fine after. So that's why, like, it doesn't have the punch that it normally would because now I think Ren's probably just gonna be fine after. After I fix all this shit. Bo 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 ba da bo bo. The station's up at the top of the. Ugh. God. That was. My mouth feels like I just ate a tree. The <laughs> ghosts? They tried to make, like, a deal with me for So am I supposed to go up here, life. then? I didn't take it, of course, but... I don't know, I, I just thought you should know. God, they're, I that must mean they're getting desperate or something. If they had any, like, power over the situation, they wouldn't try to work out a compromise. Anyway... That's true! Hello? Anyone there? What? Are they...? Oh, they're, um, they're somehow... I guess they're somehow broadcasting or something from the uh, station speakers. Are you guys at the station? Well, how are they anybody doing that? Jonas uh, beats me. I mean, Jonas? there has to be like punch a switch on their end or something to control the uh, talk. They should punch Alex right if you can hear this. Jonas, don't listen. Oh, you know what I mean. We're all set here for the Did end. I get this? The thing? With the stuff. The machinery, speak and hug, or whatever yeah, we're doing. Yeah, let's do it. Time's wasted. I thought we were supposed to be in the tower. How are you guys? I'm actually wasted. Like I feel my body wasted away. No. Yeah, this is the one I couldn't open. Dealing with stuff. We had to deal with stuff. Shut up. What stuff? Shut up. The uh, when I almost kind of slipped and fell off the bridge. Oh my God, you guys. That. No, it was. Shut this. up. It was psychotic to watch. Like almost doesn't quite describe. 
Can I just, can I just, can I just do my shit here? It wasn't that. You were perilously close to tumbling into the ocean from like 5,000 feet. go. It wasn't that high. It was like, it was high. Believe me. There we go. Boom. No, it wasn't. Yeah, it was. Shut. Hello. We're here. We made it. Hello. Oh, hello. This is Edward Island's emergency. How may I help you? If you're being sat on by a very large burglar, just mash the dial with your fist, please. <laughs> oh, thank God. I'd like to report a poltergeist. They've come into my house. They've shaved all my cats. They look better in my mittens. Oh, I just need any and all advice you can give me. Well, first... Can everyone just shut up. Thank you, you Jonas. Phone time when you get home. Yeah, I guess he's right, actually. Okay, all right. Fine. Signal verified. Shelter TF1 open. Nice. I guess it worked. Hey, we're awesome. <laughs> awesome enough, at least. Right. See you at the shelter. Over and out. Good use of terminology there, Nona. See, you're supposed to say over before you finish a uh, conversation. Over. And then when the conversation is completely done, it's over and out, bro. Close the time hole and save the day. <laughs> Oh god, that's an amazing objective name. Close the time hole! Save the day. Always high on my list of priorities. I like the music. It's very like wartime. Like bum 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 bum. It's cool. I like old timey stuff. Old vintage stuff. Let me go faster. I want my little legs to go faster. Jonas, you got giant legs. Why aren't you any faster? Oh, I'm this way, right? Yeah. I know there's probably more anomalies that I have to find. That I'm not getting. I don't know if that's gonna leave me with a bad ending or not, but... I just, I just kind of want to continue the story. Oh, like, everything feels like it has a rush and an anxiety to it that I, I feel like I have to get them done. And if I don't, and I just go searching around the place all the time, I feel like everything kind of slows down. And I don't like that. I have an idea, Mr. Jordan. Couldn't we have him reborn? Oh no, come on, Jonas, don't turn a freak- Am I- am I going down? Yes. He now. Okay, 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 I'm- Jesus Christ, I really hate that. Samesies. But I'm- I think, um... What is oh, it? No. Like, I what does get it this. feel like when that happens? Is you forget stuff, really. Like what you're supposed to be doing, or... I usually forget my dad's name to start. And then it snowballs into not remembering how to walk or talk, and... Well, that is quite weird. Look, it's scary, needless to say, when I, like, drown or whatever in my own you body. shut the fuck starting up! starting to feel like... Just, like, how do I say this? Because I don't want to... This isn't like a big thing. I just want to say... I just, I think it would have been cool us living together for, for whatever, senior year. And I'm just glad I met you, that's all. Oh, I'm just you. glad we met. <laughs> I'm glad too, okay? So there, it's out in the open, we're both glad. Okay, good. So, that's it. And now we can go back to the whole escaping and trying to live another day thing. Yes, we can. Yeah, let's finish strong now, no half-acidness at the end. Cool. Now I can see this. His body was found hanging from a tree in the I'm sure I want to listen to this. George 3. Ah, it'll be good having somebody else here to watch after the grounds, Bill. I was at Park Warden in Grants Pass, so this will be old hat to me. William Marshall, a local park ranger working in Edwards Forest, killed himself today after what his wife describes as a years-long battle with depression. His body was found hanging from a tree in the- Jesus Christ! Wait, how do I go back up again? There we go. Sometimes it no work as good. Okay. I'm getting a lot of- wait, let me just go in here and check letters. Where was I supposed to be getting these? What? Who was your concern? This island is a lie. I have compelled... I have been compelled by both forces outside my control and my... Oh, I... We got this already. Oh, two photos left. That's a good one. 
I, I like how you can see the demon's shoulders in that one. This also a good one. It's a kind of subtle one, but you can still see him. This one, oh, I didn't know there was one of me and Michael, now I'm sad. These ones don't have demons in them. I like this one, because Nona's face is close, and Jonas's is far away. It's a good perspective shot. And a Clarissa in the middle of it, not giving a shit. I want paint of this. I want like an artwork hanging on my wall of something from this game. It's very nice. Also again, all the artwork all you guys have been making for this is absolutely incredible. Some of you have some seriously strong artistic talents. And it's so cool to see, because this game makes for some really cool imagery. Like, people standing with the radio. Like, like the first thumbnail I did, I wanted to have it like me standing with the radio like this. With my hand on it, and then like the triangle in the background, but I couldn't find the right pictures and images to make it work. And I don't have a radio here that I could use. So I, I kind of improvised, but I like, like the idea of the tuning thing in the background. It's really cool. You guys are awesome. Thank you. It's a fun game too. Although I do think that they talk just a slight bit too much. Especially for a let's play. For playing on your own at home. It might still be a little annoying but probably just less because you don't need to talk out loud as much. But for me it's like... When do I get the talk? That took an hour! Okay, I'm gonna- I'm just gonna say one thing and then I promise it'd be the last time I bring it up tonight. But, you know you screwed up with Ashley at the concert, right? I mean it's not a giant thing, but still. Who's Ash? Who's Ash? Oh, you mean Amanda? My really good friend Amanda who's moving away forever? That Amanda? Yeah, that Amanda, who stole her mom's car. And I don't care if you didn't know she didn't have permission to take it, cause whatever, fine. But you knew you didn't have permission to go to that show. <sighs> Just tell me it's the last time I hear about you stealing a car. However inadvertently, my little heart can't handle the excitement. It'll be the last time, but... Maybe Shit, am I supposed to say something to him think. again this time? I don't really care about the reasons, just for my own sanity, don't do it anymore. Oh, and I sure. wanted to say, um, <laughs> per your advice, I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna really, um, like, commit to Clarissa. <laughs> that sounds dumb, like I'm pinning her or something, but you, you know what I mean. Wow, big man on campus, I don't know why I said that. Big step, that's what I mean, big step. Eh, it's not a big deal. I'm just letting you know, so... I don't know. I don't know why. I just wanted to tell you. Come on, let's get hey, to the bro. century before the last boat comes. I gotta get the uh, visual aid for the history project. And then I just gotta write the stupid essay. What history project? They still make you do, like, work with so little left in the year? Unfortunately. This is... It's just like a town history thing for civics, you know? So it's forced me to kind of... I don't know. And I mean... It's funny, I don't know if I even want to be here next year. It's just all so flat. Same people, the same expressions. Really? Why leave? I mean, yeah, it can suck sometimes, but it's pretty much like everywhere else. This is gonna sound weird, but everybody knows me here. I know you think I have it on easy street, but people looking at you all the time, wanting evidence that it's good, that they lived here, that good things can happen to people that are from here, it can get to be a real drag. Like, how about somebody else be captain of whatever for once? Give me a rest. You are... are great, though. And... and you're gonna be great whatever you do. I'm sure of it. You got spunk, kid. Yeah, well... <laughs> Maybe uh, use a let's different head word. back before Karen Strands is here. You know, when we saw Uncle Pete last month, I wanted to ask him, because he, he got out moving to New York. And I asked him if it was hard leaving. Know what he said? It was hard? Oh, God, Michael, I have no idea. I mean, knowing Uncle Peter, he was probably three sheets to the wind. He said the hardest part was deciding what to take with him and what to leave behind. I thought it was, I don't know, for him, <laughs> kind of almost touching. Oh, my, how profound. I can't believe Uncle Pete's a mere failed actor and not teaching philosophy at Berkeley. <laughs> oh, shut up. Wait, so did we get the thing you needed? <laughs> I cannot believe I had to pick you up from the police station because of Grand Theft Auto. I mean, that is too funny. <laughs> hey, it's a good game. Stop it. Oh, those are nice little moments, though, between them. It really shows the bond that they had. But again, 
Did I get the thing that he needed? I should have looked at the statue. Oh, stop God. it. Just stop. Ugh. You got, you know, you went bad again. I couldn't get you out of it. We should really, we should get this done now. Yep. I saw, I saw Michael again. I just. Right, am I going the right way? I'm sorry. When I'm there, oh, I no, just no, get sucked in into it way. like nothing happened. Come on. It's all right. I think I can hear Ren and Nona down there. Ears of a rabbit, Jonas. I can't hear anything. Do you hear this music, though, Jonas? Just Wait. don't say anything to them, okay? This is... Say anything about what? What are you guys talking about? We're dating. We're dating. Nona and I, we're gonna date. Oh, Dude, what did I just Aww. say? What? They asked, right? You asked? Mazel tov on the happy couple. <laughs> Thank you. No, stop. It's one date. At the Revival Theater. We're just gonna sit quietly in the dark and watch a documentary on Bosnian genocide. Hmm. How romantic. romantic. <laughs> hey, one man's depressant is another chick's upper. Aw, how cute. Riviera is a great movie house. And the ushers can't tell where you're putting your hands if you sit in row G, by the way. Please don't tell him that. Anyways, I know it's stupid to be planning or whatever for this, but I don't know. I just feel like maybe it's not that insignificant or whatever. Whatever. Truly, <laughs> totally, the language of love. dude. <laughs> Shut up. You know what I mean. Good. I'm glad. This is. I mean, at the very least, I'll get to hear embarrassing stories. So. I. I want to get this off my chest. Just something happened to us tonight, Alex. Something broke. I don't know if it was the ghost or whatever, but you've been acting like not you. Ren. No. I just. I don't know. Well, I'm. Sorry, I don't... I don't know what else to say, really. I'm sorry. I don't know why I'm even saying this now. This is stupid, but... Can we, like, take a picture? Why? What is I happening? don't know. In case things go bad and... What's going on? Yeah, let's do it. We're on a beach. Kind of. Let's keep a shred of normal here. Sure. Right, let's take it. Oh, so I'm sorry I haven't here. been acting normal. Uh, ghosts. You're not getting out of it. The, All right. Was I blinking? I feel Once like I blinked. There, the door won't open again since the system's so convoluted. So, make sure you're ready to finish this before we go inside. I'm going in. I, I want to go in. I want to go in. I can't go in. Let me go in. Oh, do I have to talk to all of you? Oh. We'll be back. Oh, I know. Oh. Am I gonna die? Oof, okay. I... Uh, all right. Oh, the fact that I have to hug them all is a bad sign. I am coming with you, you know. Yeah, yeah. There, I got the good ending. That game's over! <laughs> See you later! <laughs> Can you just end here so I don't have to go through the misery of whatever the fuck is gonna happen inside this? Oh. That is not the picture we took! But that's a good one. Is there any demons in that? I don't see any demons. 6 a.m. Listen, Alex. I don't want to say anything to Ren or Nona, but the truth of it is, I'm not feeling too awesome right now. Yeah, same. It's kind I had of burritos earlier. They're not sitting worse. well. Actually. Just hang in there, Jonas, okay? This is cool. I know you feel like a garbage snowman right now, but we're almost done. A garbage snowman? Hey, what do you call a man who's short of time? Huh? Have you heard this one? Mm, no clue. Tim. You call him Tim. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, it's not one of my finest. Then tell me one of your finest. <laughs> Funny joke. <laughs> oh, best. Hey, tape player. It's. It feels like wrong to see one of these when we're not in a, a time loop, right? <laughs> Yeah, it kind of does. Maybe we are in time loop! No, there's no VHS- wait! No, there's no VHS above my head. It's kind of spooky, right? The beds? Thinking they would have slept here while the rest of us burned? Yeah, but do you think it would even have worked? Like, if- if Yugoslavia or whoever dropped an A-bomb on their heads, I don't know if this place would have held up. Yeah, maybe not. It's kind of sad to think about. I don't think when people- 
get into a bomb shelter to just go in and go to bed? <laughs> Come on. Give daddy that blue. Give that. Oh, there it is. Oh, wait for it. Wait, before. Oh! Look, if something happens on the other side of this door, just don't be stupid. Cut and run, okay? If I turn into dead weight or start freaking out, just get to the boat. Do whatever you have to. Jonas, we're all getting out of here. I mean, look, we're about to fix this in two minutes. Two minutes. This is microwave popcorn of a problem. I'm not asking, I'm telling. Look, dream a little dream, buddy. It's not gonna happen. I'm not gonna leave you. Now, let's just get this door open, do what we gotta, and get home. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, you know what? There's, there's like the tenth time we've heard this song all night. There is something going on with... Like, why would this specific tune be all over the place? I have to okay, know... Okay, if it'll make you feel better, we'll investigate the case of Jonas's mom's weird song before we save our lives. Sounds perfect. It's like breaking or something. Can you... can you fix it? I mean, it's just... It's... it sounds like it's her. Like a recording, or it's just... it's my mom. That's her voice in the static. You can hear that, right? I mean, I know you don't know what she sounded like, but you can hear that. The voice, right? Yeah. I can kind of hear it. Is it possible? Do you, th do you think it's possible? I mean, we've been, like, talking with ghosts the entire night. Do you think it's like it could be, right? It's possible. I mean, a lot's happened tonight in this general realm of craziness, so I'm not going to rule it out. God, she's, like, so close. You can just... Can you just try and tune in the signal? This tape player thing isn't even... I have no clue what's going on, but... Uh, sure, I, I can I can try. I'm curious, I man. Yeah, I'm not leaving. This, I don't know how to get this clearer or whatever. I feel like I read somewhere. I just can't... just can't really get this to change or... Uh, Mom, can you... Uh, I feel like I've read somewhere, somebody in the comments or something said something about Jonas's mom. Is he gonna do the... Because I need some sort of indication that I'm doing the right thing. Keep going. Are we getting close? God almighty, why does it have to be the arse end of this? Come on. Anything? Whoa. Jonas, wait! Whoa! Whoa! What's happening? Jonas, where... Where oh, did you go? Shit. Come back! Ah, oh, balls! Well, into hell I go! Where's your door into the cave? Does Jonas come back in time to talk to his mom? No, because normally when I... Do that, I get possessed, apparently. I don't know. Maybe he's dead? You never know, it's a possibility. You know, the truth is, we could have left whenever we wanted. We weren't prisoners of the cave. Not in whole. Then why use my friends? Back at the start. Why, why are you switching with them? Why are you doing this? Because it's scary, that's why. Have you ever stared into nothing and moved with it and felt a part in it? It's worse than when we were wilting into atoms. Worse than dying the first time. Yes, I have, actually. Oh, what? Sitting in your room breaking for your brother? You're like this one. Whatever you think you can do, you can't. Yes, I can. I'm awesome. Going back, we won't go back. Child, wait your turn. Okay, do I have to tune into this? Or do I have to keep going? Probably have to keep going, but I'm a try anyway. Oh, never mind. Here we go. I'm tapping into Pink Floyd. Oh, this feels bad. 
bad. Oh, that's a lot of them. But this has always worked before. Oh, that's a lot of triangles. It's a giant one. Is this the nothingness? Uh, is anybody... Can anybody hear me? Clarissa? Maybe? Hello? Somebody there? Oh god, I'm underwater. Guess not. I'm under the sub! Holy fuck, that's cool! Yeah, I've come to close the hole. I've come to to do what Maggie Adler tried to do 50 years ago, all right? <laughs> okay, well, it didn't work then. Why would it work now? Because oh, I'm better. so spoiled. You don't even know the cost of things. <laughs> Closing the hole with your stupid toy. That's creepy. We'll your, your friends from our bloom, sure. But we'll seal you up in here with us. You'll die with us again and again. So think long and hard about those friends. You're just trying to scare me. That isn't... That can't be the only way. One last kiss. You die. You die. You can leave, you know. Through the gate you opened. And we keep the girl. Oh, no! What? No way! I'm not... I'm not just gonna abandon Clarissa. Who, who do you think I am? Who do... Who do you think we are? Do you think we wanted to be thrown away? Like some faulty appliance? We won't Nona. let it end like that. We can't. How can I fix it then? Just... Just tell me how to fix it. I'm here. I'm in the... The past, for God's sake. I can't change this somehow? No, you can't change... Before, you can't change anything. We can feel this binding. You have maybe just a few moments left. We feel terrible, we do, but but you have to know why that everyone chose to forget about us. Everyone just shuttered us away into a back closet of their thoughts. They built a monument for you. How could you say that everyone forgot? Oh, the monument, the memorial, the hunk of metal. It's a bomb for their injured pride that they let one of their own fall. It won't hurt. We don't think the change, <laughs> but we hope the trip was worth it. Seeing the depraved. So I either have to stay here and let them all live, the or go and they keep Clarissa. Think about a little submarine footrest if you fancy that sort of thing. Come on, they're trying their best. They just want to like commemorate you the only dumb ways they know how. Yes, commemorate us through commerce. How noble! This conversation is meaningless. Uh oh. <laughs> now, now what? C can I turn into some fun time jams? In the breach? Or anything? Does this do anything in here? Highly doubtful. Oh. We can see how long you stay on the throttle. Just don't blink. I can't exactly care what happens to no! me. No! Right? If I can save everyone else, that's more important. You don't know what you speak of. So is this me basically committing to leaving Alex behind? I mean, I know I said Clarissa was a bitch and everything, but... I don't want her to die. I don't want Alex to die either. There must be another way! I mean, yeah, I know I could probably leave, but does that mean Clarissa is stuck then? I'll do one more thing and see what happens. Wake up! This person 
actual home save those morons and not yourself. Don't you understand? This isn't the road you want to be on. You can't talk me out of this, all right? Ah, shit. Oh! I kind of want to save Alex. I don't want to sacrifice Clarissa, but I know a lot of people want me to save Alex as well. That Clarissa didn't do a whole lot and she was mean to me and Alex is cool and I like Alex. Ooh, I hate these decisions in games. Oh, I'm going with my gut. Oh, very good. You know a good burger when you see one. Sorry! Yeah, I'm... I, I just want to go home. Believe us when we say we understand completely. Oh, Clarissa, I'm sorry. Goodbye, Alex. God gave us memory, the saying goes. And that is all he gave us. So remember your friends as they were. Because they will never be that. Ever again. It's me now. Like my my Jonas? Steam name. Jonas, where where are you? Okay. This is, this is gonna be fine. Just work through it. Tell Michael to break up with Clarissa. It's for the best. But Michael's dead. How could I even Whoa, wait, what what's happening? Whoa! Hello, are you? Because it was me saying there? it. Jonas, if you're still there, this would be a great time to say something. When the time comes, let Jonas talk to his mom. That's why I fucking remember it. His mom's dead. I know his mom's dead. What, what is? How, how is this possible? What's going on? So it was me talking to myself, but how? Well, that could have gone better. <sighs> right. This is where I saw Wade's one. I, d I, I don't know which one to pick. Don't influence Michael. Just don't try and influence Michael. He can live his own life. What does this... What does this matter? He's dead. He's not... He's not here. <sighs> Oh, that's awesome! So it didn't matter what the fucking choices were then! Because I just made them arbitrarily at the end anyway! Are we... Fixed? <laughs> Hello? Don't have the radio anymore. Michael! That's a cool room. <laughs> oh, hey, I didn't even know you were home. You're always so quiet. It's like living with a little fairy tale mouse. Are you back? Are we back now or? Wait, did I ask uh, that? Yeah, I'm back. I was only going to be at Terry's house for the game. I've been like struggling with this stupid speech, the graduation thing. I don't want it to be just the usual blah blah we've come so far type stuff. It should have like a point, right? It should bring you to your feet about something. Uh, sure, yeah. Give it a theme. I'm guessing mom probably told you about my scholarship to state, right? I don't really know how I feel about it. I mean, I feel it's not like it's a bad thing. It's a good thing, obviously. What is it? Don't want to go? Like, are you thinking of another school or? Nah, it'd be that school if it was going to be a school. It's just, you know, it seems like half the teachers are alumni and... Actually, I'm about to be really arrogant and presumptuous and say mean things for no real reason other than I think I know better, so forget it. I have bored you enough. Michael, say it. Come on, you can't take me to the water's edge of an idea here and then not jump in. That's just cruel. No, no, really. I'm talking out of my ass. It's fine. Listen, here's the... <sighs> you can't tell mom or dad. 
but Clarissa and I are talking about just leaving. Getting Whoa. an apartment somewhere and, and just doing our own thing, you know? Getting what? Mike, you're kidding me, right? I mean, I know you said you were going to commit or whatever, but isn't running off like you're in Badlands taking it a bit far? Oh, come on. It's not that crazy. She's been really pushing for it, wanting to look for places, and uh, I'm into the idea. I really am. I just, I wouldn't feel right about it if I didn't have your, like, blessing first. Ah, oh, shit. So, can you just wave your hand over my head or something and say I'm all right to do this? <sighs> Michael, you... No. You have a lot that you can do and a lot ahead of you, and... And I don't think tying yourself to your high school girlfriend in such a risky way is the smart play here. It's not supposed to be. It's not supposed to be the safe play. That's like the whole thing of it. But I know what you're saying. Alex, just get good friends, okay? And when you're with those friends, just say yes to everything. And keep away from boys when you talk to them. It feels like you're performing. But also, stay away from girls who look you in the eye for too long. Mm. And match every beer with a water. And take classes outside of school. Classes you don't need. Michael, what is... What's this for? What, what are you doing? This is just... This is a just-in-case package, okay? Just in case I'm not around. And I love you, and you're amazing, and that's Aww. it. So... I love you, too. Oh, no! But soon, I shall be so I cannot remember any but the things that never happened. Yeah, I... I don't know. Hey, look who's finally awake. Maybe don't get up immediately. Michael, how... What's happening? Well, it's a combination of things, I guess. Michael carried you here from the cave. Because you were, you know, comatose. What? She doesn't. It's okay. You don't care. What's happening is that the tuning thing we did in the cave, it worked. The ghosts are gone. We're going home. Or at least they've... They've stopped trying to eat our souls. Wait, wait, wait. Is, is Clarissa... Is, is she okay? Because I, I think I'm... I might have... Clarissa? Who's that? You're looking at who came. This oh, is the group. Oh, no. She's known as best friend. She she came here with us. H how can you not remember this? Alex, no Clarissa came with us. I don't even... I don't know anyone named Clarissa. Yeah, I don't either. Um, I don't... No. No, you're just confused still. You're fine. She's fine. It's just been a stressful night, to say the least. But we all, you know, survived. Thanks, as always, to the brother-sister duo of Alex and Michael. Oh, shut oh, up. Oh, come on. <laughs> just saying. We, like, totally help sometimes. Yeah. Jonas and I, like, hid really well. Did I, like, accidentally change the the past here? I don't know. Did you? I don't really... I don't really feel like anything's changed. I don't know. Maybe? I, I don't know what to, like, clench to feel if I did or not. Well, anyways, before I forget, my heartfelt apologies to Jonas. Buddy, this was not what I meant when I said this would be a good time. Sorry about that. I mean, I invited the poor guy. He just moved here with his dad, and... Um, no, seriously, it was somehow worked out. We've all... Wait, Ren, you... you brought Jonas? Yeah, he's, I was just gonna ask! Him? Yeah, I... man, you've really been affected by all this. I invited him because he's new in town, and... and whatever. Yeah, and he turned out to be a cool guy, so what's the problem? <laughs> Thanks. I mean, Alex, you're acting like... I don't even know. Yeah, he's... A, he's more than a cool guy. He's... he was like... <laughs> he was like what? Yeah, what... what do you mean? He was like... like my stepbrother. Really? What are you even talking about right now? No, no, I get it. I mean, it's like after a long plane ride, you bond with your seatmate. <laughs> Good analogy. I can't believe everything that happened. I just... I feel like we should tell everyone we know. Like, go on a freaking book tour, but... I think we'd sound nuts, honestly. I, I mean, it's not like... It's not like we have any proof any of this actually happened. Hey, is this your book? Oh, man. This is... We're gonna be the best couple ever. Uh, okay. Slow down. I lost it on the way. I thought for sure some commuter would have just tossed it overboard. Hey, or... that reminds me. What were we... We were talking about something stupid right before Alex woke up. Prom? Uh, prom. 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 You guys have fun with that. Pro prom, am I right? Alex? Are we supposed to still spike the punch or just bring in flasks? Uh, seriously, who cares about prom? Who ever cared about prom? But, like, especially now. All right, you know what? It's picture time. Again? Um, come on. Oh, come no, on. No. What? We earned this one. Yeah. Bominos, let's move it. I'm not going to say no anything on this one. No whining. I want to see what happens. Let's, um, let's actually move outside so we can get the light. Sure. 
Ren, what is that book, anyway? I don't know. I can hardly make heads or tails out of what the hell he's talking about half the time. Here's good for the... yeah, just here. What is the book? And who like, is this, look, our captain? I'll just pick a random-ass page. Come on, Alex. Get in here. Like this, here. When I was younger, I could remember anything, whether it happened or not. But soon, I shall be so I cannot remember any but the things that never happened. Yeah, I... I don't know. Okay, everyone. Wait, didn't you... Cheese! Before we'd left, I told my mom I was spending the night at a friend's house. And when I got back, I didn't see any reason to change that story. And you know what? I still don't. The island did one good thing, forcing Ren and Nona together. Which is nice, because they're still together, actually. Though they go to different schools now. Trying out the long distance thing, I guess. You and 69% of players brought Nona and Ren together. Oh shit, Nobody I'm not looking forward to these Carissa, statistics. Except me, of course. And I think about her every single day, to be honest. I don't know if it was the right thing to do. I think most people would say it wasn't, but most people will never have to face something like that. Whoa, 5% of players. Oh, Jesus. Since Michael never left, we never had our going away thing at the lake, and so he never drowned. He stayed in town to get an engineering degree. He's content, but he sometimes thinks he would have been happier trying to go out on his own. I don't know. Oh, Jesus Christ. Jonas never remembered my version of things, though I held out hope for a while that he would. We still hang out all the time, though. He goes to school in town. I call him my other brother. Not to his face. Don't tell Mike. <laughs> It's funny, what happened on the island used to pop into my head every single day, and then every other day. And then a week went by and I realized I hadn't thought about it at all. I guess that's, I don't know, it's good, I think. But anyways, I, um, well, if it matters, I'm taking some time off. Just to, I don't know, readjust my priorities, figure out what I want to do. But anyways, oh, what time is it? <gasps> yeah, sorry, I gotta run or I'll miss the ferry. Ren's dragging me out to Edwards Island for that yearly beach party thing. And I have to pick up what's-his-name Jonas, too. <sighs> I hope he's not weird or mean or something. Whatever, I'm sure it'll be fun. It's something to do, right? Oh god, it just looped. They're all going back to the thing again, but... If I play it again, will Michael be there instead of Clarissa this time? Oh god, I feel so fucking bad. But one, one thing I want to get across, I know the decision was probably a shit one, and at the end it was like only you and 5% of other players did that. But I'm trying to think... How many people went back and played this game and like looked it up online and everything? Ghost Alex Adler. Wade. Ha, <laughs> that's awesome. And Vernon. Oh. There are other people who I have friends with who played the game on Steam. Dude, that's cool. Yeah. Michael's in the pictures now. So, what I want to know is... How many of those decisions are, like, if I go back and play the game again, and then I get all the perfect decisions, get all the perfect endings and everything, will my things change at the end? Well, let's say, like, you and 5% of players saved everybody, or something like that, or 50% of players saved everybody, like, I want to know how much of that is that, like, because what I feel like I got is one of the, the shittier endings. Maybe. So maybe people went back and changed their endings, and that changed all the statistics. Yeah, Michael's there now instead of Clarissa. So I want to know if I'm left with the 5% of players who played it through the first time and got that as their thing or if it's counting first playthroughs Because then that's really bad, and I got a, I got a terrible one. Well, that was the thing like 
I felt bad leaving either of them, but I felt worse if I left Alex. Because we've gotten a lot closer to her, and it sucks leaving somebody else behind, and it's cool to be the noble one who sacrificed yourself and everything. But at the same time, I didn't bond heavily with Clarissa in the game. Not just Alex bonding with her, there's no ghost in it this time. But I mean, like me as a player, I didn't bond very heavily with her. Um, I'm trying- I wonder if there's anything else at the end of this. Overall, very cool game. I really like that. I like the idea of the time loop stuff. Um, maybe if I play it again, the time loop stuff won't happen. Maybe it's just showing it here. How it would have been. Where's Jonas? Is Jonas then the one that got possessed and fell out the window? I don't know. Powered by? Unity, of course. I was gonna say it, but Unity makes every freaking game these days. It's crazy to see how far that engine's coming along. It's kind of weird that they still, like, they took the picture. How are they now have a camera in their hand? And I like how it leaves a gap for Clarissa anyway. Because it seems like they just stick Clarissa in at the end if you actually save everybody. If that's even an option. Which I assume it is if you... I think it has to do with those beacons that I was finding around the place. Maybe if I found all of them and how I reacted in some of the situations like the... The ghost interaction kind of things. Maybe I could have saved people there. I'm gonna see if anything happens or if it's just gonna go back to the main menu. Probably just gonna go back to the main menu. I wonder if there's like a new game plus. Now I get why... Continue timeline? Okay, let me just check this. I want to see be a military base. I want to see what characters well, are at the start. Oh, thing. Then Jesus! Then it was turned into an army thing. Then it became a bird thing and a museum or whatever. Henry Fonda stationed here, I think, for a bit. Unless oh, he shit's maybe. messing up. Who's Henry Fonda? Around Christmas time, this little breakfast place used to sell these amazing polar bear sugar cookies. Man, those were good. And then one year they changed the formula or whatever. I don't think anything's like, different. He's saying all the same stuff. Alex. Hey, still with us? Um, you haven't said anything for like 10 Yeah, this is... Sorry, but this is so familiar. Like, I don't know, I feel like you've said all this before. Well, yeah, I'm sure I've said it to you before, but it's new to Jonas. And he's downright enraptured. Right? Huh? Right. So you all moved in? Um, not... Oh, wait, not really. I wanna see. I just got in this morning. And how did her mom meet your dad exactly? Ah, uh, <laughs> they met on. Okay, so it is the same thing. It's the same interaction. I was like, I want to see if it's um, Jonas and Alex have the relationship this time, or if it's Ren and Jonas, the way he was kind of setting it up. So the new game plus isn't like that, which I guess makes sense. But man, that's really interesting. Now I can definitely see why people were saying you'll want to play through it a few times. Holy crap! I'm not gonna play through it again for YouTube or anything like that. The ending I got is the ending I got. That's how I played it naturally. That's how things happened. Just, that's how I would have played it if I wasn't even making a video on it, so... I kinda wanna keep it at that. I, I feel like if there's better endings to get that, other people have likely gotten them in videos and that. I, I don't know. Maybe I'll just make a video getting all... Getting the best ending or something like that, but I'd have to play through the entire game again just to get that. And I don't know if it's worth it, but I want to talk about the game a little bit. Let's go back to the main menu. Um, very cool game. Kind of blew my expectations. Well, I didn't really have many expectations going in because I didn't really know what the game was about. And I just knew people had high praise for it. And after playing it now, I can definitely see why. It was a very, very cool game. Some really cool characters, a cool setup. I feel like it kind of fell flat in some places. Like the stuff it was setting up with all the ghosts and the... The stuff in the caves, like the lights shining down, tuning in and everything. Kind of just turned into a sort of like, end of the world ghost story type of thing at the end, which... I don't know, I don't know what I expected it to be. But I, I felt like it was teasing something a bit cooler than the way it paid off. It felt like it had some really crazy twists and secrets to lay out and then it didn't really hit those marks. But it was still a very strong story and I really, really love the idea of multiple playthroughs and other people playing the game like your friends on Steam or PlayStation or whatever platforms that this game is on 
going through the game already and then you coming back through it again and seeing their interactions or seeing your own interactions because if you don't have anybody to play with or if you don't have any friends in your like Steam or whatever that you're playing it on then going through it the first time you end up giving your own answers back the second time you go through it and there is huge incentive to go back and play it again without any of that stuff so that that's really cool I really that's really taking advantage of the medium of video games that I really wish more games tested out not just this general concept but like video games are a very special type of entertainment format a lot of people just try to tell a movie through a video game which isn't the, the right way of doing it I feel like video games because they're an interactive medium they have a lot to offer beyond just oh we're telling a story so it's a cool way of doing it I think Undertale did some cool stuff like that as well um, and Dark Souls and Bloodborne those types of games tell uh, they're, they're a bit different they're a bit more subtle in their regard but having other players come into your world and just interacting with the medium like Undertale interacts with your save files on your system like very few games do these types of things and um, sort of abuse the whole gamut of what a video game can do and it's really cool when games actually do that and this reminds me of that game Morai that I played M-O-R-A-I I played it on the channel a few months back where you go into a cave and you see somebody and they ask you questions and then you're like oh I don't know what that's all about and then it makes sense at the end that it's other players like talking to you kind of thing I love that that's very very cool very neat idea and I love that so much some really good things about this game the voice acting top notch the sound effects the, or not the sound effects the music was very very cool some of the sound effects as well were actually really cool the whole distorted VHS type of stuff and the flashes of the images and everything art style was phenomenal it was absolutely incredible to look at I love that so much it's one of my favorite things about the game was just the general look of everything I would love just some wallpapers on my computer of some of the, uh, the backgrounds in this game um, and the story was very cool it might not have hit the notes that I thought it was gonna hit I feel like again it was hyping up something greater than what it delivered but what it delivered was still really really good and I'm very very satisfied with that not really satisfied with the ending I got and I imagine a lot of you out there weren't really satisfied with the ending I got and with these types of games everyone gets very gets very aggressive in the comments so please let's keep it civil I might not have gotten the best decision or I might not have gone with some of the decisions you would have gone with but that's the point of these playthroughs is that it's what I would have done naturally myself as I played the game and there's always the option for you to go play it yourselves or to watch somebody else do it and see what the other interactions are because uh, I know that happens with The Walking Dead every time when everyone gets very very angry at me for the decisions I make even though in my head they have solid logic and solid reasoning or sometimes I just pick what my instincts want to pick or what I'm feeling in the moment so for these types of games just bear that in mind before you lash out at anybody um, I don't know, what else do I want to talk about? I do feel like the characters talk too much. It was cool and I know what they're kind of going for. It's a, I call this the Uncharted effect. That Uncharted was one of the games that came around, like the first Uncharted. When it came around the characters talked to each other a lot and it was the first time anybody had really seen such like really strong interaction between player and NPC character or uh, character that came along with you, like escort characters. And because more often than not these escort characters were just There for you to have another game mechanic, but uncharted kind of brought them along. It was like oh They have actually like a really cool relationship and they have a lot of banter and everything And I know RPGs have done this for a while, but uncharted was the first ones to really nail that kind of like movie effect of like The other player could actually be a character other than just the one you control type of thing Without ever you getting control over it. They just talked a lot but they did it very well and then after that a lot of games tried to do the same thing where characters talked a lot to each other but they kind of fucked up the pacing of it and this was this kind of messed up the pacing of it a small bit I, I feel like the characters talked a little bit too much like the moments when I use good examples where you sit down and it's like let's tune into this with our radio let's unlock the gate and then you're like okay and then I tried to say something to you this is a very specific example for let's players but I imagine if you're at home playing it on your own you have stuff to think about and then these characters are like any minute now come on Alex let's use the thing to unlock the game like, I get it let's just let's just stay silent for a second I know you're trying to make them seem like real people by saying stuff all the time I, I really do get that but sometimes it was a little bit too much at times 
And not just for Let's Plays. I'd still get annoyed with it sometimes, even in my spare time just playing the game. Um, but it, it was few and far between. Most times, they did fill the gaps between moving around the environment a lot. And when you had to travel around the place, it was nice to get tidbits of the story here and there and get, learn more about the character. And that's what this type of stuff does, is that it's character building. It's world building. And I, I, I liked it more than I disliked it, put it that way. Um, I have more positives to say about the game than negatives. But overall, that was Oxenfree. I don't really know how much I can say about theorizing towards the end of it. Because I feel like the game pretty much self-explained everything towards the end. There wasn't a whole lot that was like, wait a minute. Because like at the end they were saying, the Clarissa thing never happened. And Michael stayed at home so he never drowned kind of thing. So... It kind of rectified its own storyline in the end, even though there's always loopholes in these things and certain things shouldn't have happened, blah, 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 blah. But overall, I think it was pretty self-explanatory. But that was Oxenfree. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I thought there was at least another episode out of it. I didn't think it would be ending already, so I, I'm not going to say apologies for that because I don't know why I'd apologize for that. <laughs> Otherwise, we'd just be padding out episodes for the sake of padding out episodes and that's not good. Um, let me know what you thought. I thought it was a really cool game. I really enjoyed that. I'm, I'm really glad I played it. A nice short little series to play. If you have any ideas for games like these or any ideas for longer Let's Plays after this, please let me know because I always like to have something like this going along that we can have like a continuous thing constantly that's not just like Subnautica or stuff like that where it's kind of, it's a continuous thing but it's kind of like episode per episode like an anthology kind of thing. I like, I like longer series. <laughs> but anyway. Thank you guys so much for watching this series. If you liked it, punch that like button in the face! Like a boss! And... Like my thumb out. Whoosh! Whoosh! Thank you guys, and I will see all you dudes! And that's Oh, it smells good, doesn't it? That would be cannibalism if you did that. Are you? Are you fucking trying? Are you trying, bro? I have killed you like I killed your brother. I'm going to bed. See you later, mister. My parents aren't here. Stranger danger. And all that jazz. Look at those ways before you cross the street. Ali Ali Oxenfree! That means you can come out. You're safe now. <laughs>